Have you ever wanted to give up something because you weren't good enough at it? Well, I just want to say today that you're not alone in that. And that's actually very, very normal. Now, outside of gaming, one of my greatest passions in life is music and songwriting. I love music. I love the places it takes me to. I love how it can make people feel empathised with and how it can take you on journeys. I don't even know how long back I started songwriting and I love to help other people develop and grow as songwriters. It's just, I've come across it a couple of times now where somebody's started, they're like, hey, I'm just learning to songwrite. And I'm like, oh, that's so awesome, great, keep at it. Then I'll catch up with them a little time later and go, oh, so how's the, uh, how's the songwriting going? Have you been working on anything recently? And they'll say, ah, I, I wasn't very good at it, so I gave it up. My question is, do you remember learning to walk? Now, what you don't remember as a kid is how many times you fell over doing it. I guess any parents out there would understand watching their kid learn to walk. The thing is, you don't quit learning to walk just because you fell over a couple of times. You keep at it, it's just an instinctive thing. But by the time we come to take up something new, maybe somebody taking up songwriting or uh, learning a new sport, or for me, learning to make YouTube videos. It's not necessarily intuitive to realize that starting from scratch, you're not going to be great at something. But bit by bit, you do get better. As I start this YouTube journey, making videos for the first time, I've never actually dealt with videos before. I just find I'm acutely reminded of how I've got a lot to learn how little bits and details in my videos uh, they, you can tell that they're amateur and that's that's fine, I'm okay with that I've taken up enough things in my life to realise that nothing comes naturally like genuinely the main thing that drives you forward is passion for what you do if you really enjoy the idea of doing that thing that, let that be your driving force. Don't let whether you're good at it decide whether you keep on with it. That's just ridiculous. It doesn't matter. If you're enjoying it, yeah, it might be frustrating that you're not so good at it right now. But you will get better. By keeping on, you develop muscle memories in whatever it is. Whether it's learning a new language, lifting that weight at the gym, just anything. You will get better. Keep learning. Opening your mind up to new ways to understand what you're doing. You know, not everyone can afford a personal trainer, but maybe that could be something for the gym. Or you look up online on YouTube videos as to how to properly lift something. For me, uh, as I'm learning on the YouTube, I'm looking up on YouTube how to promote my channel, how to do all these sort of little things and I'm trying to figure it out for myself and it's really fun. I'm actually really enjoying learning. I'm really enjoying that. I don't know everything right now and that's okay because I'll get there. Bit by bit I'll get there. Just as right here in this clip I'm learning how to reel in this fish and I'm just it's my first time doing it on this game and the mechanics are a bit weird. You've got to keep that bar exactly where that fish icon is. And I do it. <laughs> if you get that thing that you're sucking at now and keep at it in a year's time, you might be like, not great at it, but you're better than you were. And then in another year's time, you might be kind of all right at it. And then, before you know it, you're suddenly actually quite good at it, and it's something that you really enjoy. Just... Just don't let baby steps hold you back, okay? <laughs> <laughs>